we will see how to install python so first we'll go to python website python.org so this is python.org you can go to download to see the different versions so here my machine is windows so i'm going to download the python 3.9.6 which is available for windows you could look at mac or other platforms based on your operating system so i'm going to download python 3.9.6 if you want to see the different religions you can click here okay and you can see this for windows linux unix mac os and other platforms okay so let's download the latest one i already have python 3.8 which i use and i'll be using 3.8 for our programs too i just wanted to download and show you how to install 3.9 so the file is already downloaded now i'm going to run it so click on it it's going to come up so see this so you have options like install now customize installation so i'm going to say install now but before that let's look at these two options so the first option down here says install launcher for all users so i'll click on it because i want everybody who works on this laptop to get access to the python software second thing which is even more important is add python 3.9 to path now it is important that we add the python uh, to path because in that case we would be able to run python from any location if we don't add this path the various softwares like command prompt or pycharm which i'm going to use in, as a ide later will not be able to recognize the path so if we put that in path python is visible to all the other applications so to avoid any errors or mistakes in future it's always better that you check this option but yeah if you miss it you can manually do it as well later so i have checked this option and now i'm going to do install now the setup is in progress now it's getting installed so setup was successful i'm going to say close so when i go to my search i'm going to say py so you see python is shown here i'm going to click on it. so you see this when you launch it you get triple angular bracket so this is sign for python prompt okay which means that our python 3.9 has been successfully installed our machine and we can start doing our program here i'm going to write a program called print which is an inbuilt function and i say hello you see it has printed hello on the screen okay that means our python is installed correctly we are able to run a program python program this is called running the program from python prompt and if you see here at the moment i hit enter it executed right so this is what we mean when we say python is an interpreter it does not wait for us to give a special command to compile the moment we hit enter it executes the line of the code